we want to plot each decimal on the number line. The first decimal is negative 0.3, or negative 3 tenths. To help us plot this on the number line, we need to recognize that negative 0.3 is between negative 1 and 0, or negative 0.3 is greater than negative 1 and less than 0. So to begin, let's plot negative 1 and 0 on the number line, where negative 1 is on the left, and zero is on the right. Notice how this interval has a length of one unit. So now we'll cut this interval into 10 equal subintervals, where each subinterval will have a length of 0.1 units, or one-tenth of a unit. So in the middle, we would have negative 0.5, and now we'll cut the interval on the left and right into five equal subintervals. And now let's label these from zero to negative one. To the left of zero, we'd have negative 0.1, and then negative 0.2, negative 0.3, negative 0.4, and so on. And now we can plot negative 0.3, or negative 3 tenths of the number line, which is here. For the next decimal, we have negative 1.64, or negative 1 and 64 hundredths. Because we have the hundredths place value here, it'll be helpful to recognize that negative 1.64 is between negative 1.7 and negative 1.6, or negative 1.64 is greater than negative 1.7 and less than negative 1.6. So this time on the number line, we will plot negative 1.7 and negative 1.6, where negative 1.7 is on the left, and negative 1.6 is on the right. And notice this interval has a length of one-tenth of a unit, so now we'll cut this interval into 10 equal subintervals, where each subinterval will have a length of one-hundredth of a unit, or 0.01 units. So in the middle, we would have negative 1.65, and I will cut the interval on the left and right into five equal subintervals. And again, each of these subintervals has a length of 0.01 units, or one hundredth of a unit. So starting at negative 1.6, we would have negative 1.61, negative 1.62, negative 1.63, negative 1.64, and so on. And now we can go ahead and plot negative 1.64. Notice negative 1.64 is just to the right of negative 1.65, which is here. I hope you found this helpful.